Hello everybody, welcome to Italy, welcome to Brembo. Now I'm sure a lot of you will be familiar with the new braking system on Gran Turismo 7 and we're here today obviously to find out all things brakes including the different manufacturing processes, the different materials and also what it means for you on your PlayStation 5 at home. And to that end I've got good company, 2021 Nations Cup champion Valerio Gallo's here. Hello everyone, for me as an Italian brand it's such an honour to visit it and also to welcome Brembo as uh, official partner of Gran Turismo 7, so I'm going to visit it very soon and yeah, let's jump in. <laughs> Alright, so Valerio and I have ventured into the Brembo factory, we're here with Mauro. Mauro, first of all, thank you for welcoming us into here. Uh, give us a brief history of Brembo and tell us how that's turned into the modern day collaboration with Gran Turismo. Uh, first of all, thank you for being here. Uh, the company born in 1961, um, as, as a small company in, in a village close to Bergamo. And uh, we start producing uh, aftermarket discs for, for production cars. Then the story of Brembo's here in 1965, when our president had been covered by Enzo Ferrari in order to start developing the brakes for Formula One. And here's where, obviously, also the iconic product of Brembo born, so the aluminum caliper. Um, the collaboration with Gran Turismo started when we started discussing uh, about the new chapter of the series and obviously they wanted to integrate our brakes in the game but then we discovered a lot of commonality in terms of development innovation. We want to be both cool brands and, and start to, to deal with a young generation and then transfer the feeling of having brand brakes also on, on virtual car. We offer our performance aftermarket brakes for GT7 and uh, is a success right now. And what can we notice about the Brembo brakes in GT7? As I said before, we're talking about performance after market brakes. So are the ones that everyone can buy to upgrade the brakes of car. So you can start upgrading just disc and pads. And so then you can change calipers and move to carbon ceramic. Every time you increase, you do a step in performance, but also a step in the style and the look of the vehicle as well. That is extremely important in Gran Turismo. Well, Mario, thank you very much indeed for welcoming us into here. Did you know also that Brembo were the first company to introduce carbon discs into Formula One and carbon ceramic brakes on a road car as well? Anyway, Valerio and I are going to head into the Brembo factory and find out a bit more about the products they make. <laughs> 